For almost three years, visitors to Harborfront Craft Studios have watched ceramics artist Alex Human Young create works that bring together a unique blend of Eastern and Western aesthetics. Alex was awarded Harborfront's highly coveted residency after graduating with honors in fine arts from the University of Manitoba. Alex was selected because, as is our goal with all our residents, to be a committed, to be committed to be a professional artist, uh, to be talented, um, to be able to work in front of the public, as the studio is an open studio, and uh, to have a concern for informing the public, for educating the public. And Alex certainly fulfilled all of those, and then some, because he is very committed, and he is, I think, one of the most talented artists we've had in the studio in our 25 years. Growing up in Hong Kong, Alex was a creative child and longed to play the piano. Unfortunately, his parents were consumed by their struggle to support the family and could never afford this luxury. They gave him no encouragement to pursue his artistic side. However, Alex was resourceful and took charge of his life. In 1991, after arriving in Winnipeg on a student visa, Alex enrolled in high school. Although he spoke some English, he lacked the fluency to fit in and was lonely for the family he left behind. I think the most difficult time was when I first came here, the first time away from home and uh, away from parents and my siblings. And uh, I think I was too old to be a teenager, to blend in to the teenager group and too young to, to fit into the mature other world. And it's very, very difficult then to make friends to, I, I was at high school and they were teenagers, but I don't know what to talk to them. We didn't listen to the same music, we didn't read the same book, we didn't see the same TV program. And it was just very difficult to find common object, subject to talk about. When Alex enrolled in the fine arts program at the University of Manitoba, his work soon began to attract attention. He was selected to represent the university at an international student exhibition, and in 1992, he received the Johnson Taboski Award for Excellence in Art. In 1994, he was awarded first prize at the Manitoba Society of Artists juried exhibition. He initiated a visiting artist exchange between Canada and Hong Kong and coordinated a trade exhibition between the two countries. Recently, Alex was the catalyst for four major exhibitions by Canadian ceramists in Hong Kong. He has participated in 25 jury and group exhibitions. Alex has won numerous awards, including the Best Ceramics Award at the Toronto Outdoor Art Show two years in a row. And most recently, the University of Minnesota has accepted his exhibition, Focus on Function. I think his work is, is very unique and it stands out. And I think that's one of the necessary things to be successful as an artist. Your, your work has to have an individualism. It has to be individual. And I think that Alex, uh, Alex knows who he is and I think that comes out in her work.